Yo, what's going on, my peoples and my peoples to be? This is Conrock Hall with another Get to the Point review. Damn it. And today we are going to review ShopRite Sushi. Let's get to it. Dang. All right, my peoples. So I'm about to crack into this. I have a whole bunch of reviews I'm doing this evening and I was trying to wait to the end to get everything done and then get to my uh, food, but brother's hungry, okay? So I'm gonna get it in with the spicy tuna roll and the salmon avocado roll and see what's goody in the hoodie. All right, my people, so let's get to the spicy tuna roll and see what's going on with that. Get my chizap sticks. Uh, okay, why do they child poof these things now? I should be able to just break them apart. Uh, voila. All right. So let's give this spicy tuna roll a crack. So I'm always a proponent before you start seasoning your stuff and it tastes what it tastes like and it's on its own without the benefit of um putting seasoning on you know you need to see what something tastes like first out the gate so oh boy oh boy okay it's the right amount of spice it's not that crazy spice that got me running for something to drink but damn Ooh, that is mm. yo that is fire I mean I I don't mean heat. I mean, tastes good. Wow. All right. Let's dip this in a little soy sauce and see what's up. Okay. Wow. Shop right. Your spicy tuna. Dang. On point. Now we're going to do the salmon avocado roll. Raw dog, no seasoning, no soy sauce, nothing like that. Let's see what's up with it. That is also, wow, on its own. Nice. Very nice. All right, now, let's dip this bad boy. Oh, maybe, maybe I wanted to look at it. That's the um, salmon avocado. Let's dip that in a little soy. Let's see what that tastes like. Let's see what's up with that. Oh, goddamn. Wow. Okay. All right, ShopRite. Wow. You don't set it off for me in the Poconos with the sushi. The quick fix just to run in to ShopRite and pick up the sushi. Let me show you what um what the um spicy tuna roll looks like. Yeah. So there you go. That's the spicy tuna. You know what I'm saying? Official tissue. And like, yo. <laughs> Alright, my people. So I believe. This is ginger. I'm gonna take a drink. It, it, ooh, good Lord, I love me some ginger. Goodness gracious. I'm gonna take a little bit of that and I'm gonna put it on this, uh, yeah, I'm gonna put it, that's too much. You gotta make it spread to be kinda skimpy with it, but it's supposed to be probably just supposed to be for a um, little bit of flavor. I'm talking like I don't know, cause I really don't know. I'm not a um, connoisseur of sushi, you know. I don't eat shellfish. I don't really go in it, but I love the, the salmon, the tuna, and the, the vegetarian taste, especially if you can find it with mango. Oh, goodness gracious. All right, so I'm gonna try this um, salmon avocado roll with, uh, with a little soy sauce on there. A little, dip, little, little dippy dip. See what's up.
goodness gracious. Eating healthy never tasted so good. Good Lord. All right, you know what? I got to do this. Now I'm going in with the spicy tuna with a little ginger on it. We're going to give this a little dippy dip. Uh-oh. Sounds like my flounder's ready. Ha <laughs> ha! All right, my peoples. Now I'm going to dip this. Uh, I got to try it. I'm going to dip the, um, the spicy tuna with a little ginger on it inside the soy sauce. Give it a, give it a crack, see what's up. Oh my God. Yo, word up. No cute shit, but yo, this salmon is like, just like, but this, these, these sushi is like busted in my mouth. The flavors are so incredible. I mean, you know how sushi is. Sushi is like this subtle taste, but all together they add up to something like really fantastic. And I'm blown away by this. I mean, this is so delicious. I'm like, I could see myself eating this like once a week. Like, well, my day's off. I tend to take my kids out, buy, take out at least once a week. And they actually requested this, okay? I could have done Popeyes. We could have did Wendy's. We could have did the Chinese restaurant. Uh, we could have did any number of pizzerias that we like to go to up here. Um, but they actually requested, requested sushi for dinner. That's all they wanted. They just get us the sushi. We're good. And yo, I'm impressed. You know, we got two, you know, cause we big dudes. So we got two packs of, uh, I guess, eight um, slices come in each pack. So I got two packs each. Um, so they can have a variety. Um, I'm blown away. Delicious. This is EB Grizz and he's giving the, what's this called Dante? Philadelphia Roll. Philadelphia Roll, all right. He's giving it a crack. You know what I'm saying? There it goes. and. What do you, as sushi goes, how is it, how is, how's it taste? Good as always. Good as always? All right, this your go-to. So between, uh, I guess, a one and a 10, what would you give it? A 10. Give it a 10. All right, my man E.B. Grizz, thank you for doing your thing. Appreciate you uh, giving us your opinion. Good shit. <laughs> you said good shit? All right. Now we got Afro the Don, AKA, Little Beefy, a.k.a. Donnie on your mommy, a.k.a. I don't know, Big Don. Big Don. <laughs> what, you, what you working with? What kind of sushi from uh, ShopRite are you working with? Uh, I got a uh, spicy tuna roll. Yes, sir. And then a uh, spicy crab roll like you had. No, I had spicy tuna. I'm allergic to crab. Oh, well then, yeah, spicy crab. All right, so go ahead, crack into it, and give me your impressions. All right. All right, that's a spicy crab roll. Mm hmm All right. Mm hmm That's good right now. Yeah. yeah. You taste the crab. Tissue, tissue. Crab. Spice really ain't nothing crazy, like what I'm, at least what I'm used to. Okay. But it's a good flavor though, you know? And it's right. something, I think it's like the, okay. I think it looks like caramel, it's sweet. I don't know what it is, but it looks sweet. All right, that's the uh, tuna. Tuna, okay. That's what I had earlier. Not bad. I wish there was a little more of a, like the cucumber in here, a little more for sort of a little more crunch. Okay. But it isn't bad though. I like it. It's not bad, you know. A little more spice flavor on this. Alright, thank you. Mm. So what do you give um ShopRite sushi? What would you say on a, on a one to ten scale? Um, all right. So this is coming from. Um, I'm gonna let y'all know now. I really ever have uh, you no know, sushi like that. You know. Um. What? I probably get another bite of this just to be accurate. Mm -hmm. I give this an eight. And a half out of mm -hmm. ten. Okay. And then this one, put a little bit of sushi. Just see what it do right now. All right, this one. It's just making a seven. Just making a seven. They can do a little more with this one, but it isn't bad though. I like it. I got it. 
So there you got it from Lil Beefy, a.k.a. Big Don. Let him know. Let him know. Just as a sidebar, uh, you know, some little time has passed and I'm just like, yo, oh my God, devouring your sushi. Uh, just so you know, I know a lot of people, especially with that hood palate, we're funny about undercooked meats. This is raw. The salmon is raw and the tuna is raw, as it says on the uh, on the label. I don't know if it's going to zoom in there. Dang, you got to come up a little bit and... Uh, Slamming, that's all I can say. This sushi is slamming. My peoples, you're in the Poconos, and I know sometimes it's hard getting the stuff that you want up here. It's not like New York City, but I'm telling you right now, the spicy tuna, the avocado and salmon, yo, dang, dang. Both on point, oh my God, I am so impressed. And this is definitely going to be one of my new favorite things to eat in the Poconos. The epitome of freshness. And, yo, all I can say is this is amazing. So, if you're in the Poconos and you're trying to get some uh, some, some decent sushi, I suggest you go to ShopRite on 611 and go and they're right as soon as you walk through the front door. They're right there, front and center. You can't miss them. Yo, get up on it, God darn it. This is Conrad Coffee. Get to the point reviews. Until the next time, my peoples. Peace.